Welcome back guys to another Boom Beach video. I am going to be doing something pretty regrettable today. It's going to be using all mechs and it, the regrettable part isn't that I, I'm probably going to forfeit a lot of these battles um, on an 11 win streak at kind of a low level here. Um, it's going to be that we are going to max out our mechs and that doesn't seem like a great use of our upgrade tokens. Actually, I'm not even sure if I'll be able to max them out here. It might get expensive. I guess not. We still have some to spare, but we have maxed out mechs now and we're gonna try some battles uh now i'm just thinking i don't really want to lose my win streak but we're not gonna be purposely losing battles the sad thing is on my main account uh or on my main base um i can hold two mechs per boat and we do not have enough gbe here um this is kind of awkward i don't have my gunboat upgraded at all but we can only hold eight mechs on the warship, and I guess now that I think about it, it's probably not that big of a deal. Because like I said, I don't have that much GBE, but I was going to say, I can hold two per boat, which means we can throw so many more down. But um, let's see how they do. I, I think they'll be able to get through these battles, I hope. Uh, the boom cannons might be a little problematic, but I think we will have enough here. And actually, bring in a... Bring and break here might be a bit of a mistake. She's just gonna. I don't really have any other hero to use, but it, she's not gonna be that beneficial, especially if she just runs out in front of these attacks. But we're just saving up. We'll get seven down, and I'm thinking about using a battle orders next time we get the GBE here instead of using it. I think that'll be pretty beneficial rather than an extra mech. So there we go. Brick is almost dead. You can see our base has fallen sadly. We can get that final mech down. Let's place them down, but um, I've seen a couple people use mechs against my base. Definitely do not use it unless you have to. If you don't have heavies unlocked for some reason, you're still using Zookas, then maybe you can use mechs. I wouldn't. Just just go for heavies and upgrade them. I mean, there's, there's really no point in using mechs, and it's kind of sad. They should have made mechs the first troop you unlock, because I nor christian think there's going to be any mech gameplay other than this this season which is sad it's because they're so stinking slow and their their damage just isn't worth it um and they're slow did i mention that uh they're they're pretty slow they're pelicans right uh, but that was it, it, it was a pretty decent attack so to speak if you don't account for time we're able to stomp that base um, maybe if they, uh, I remember in an earlier season, it would be, it was like a percentage based attack where they made defense way overpowered and you just had to get the higher percent rather than the quicker speed runs here on the base. And I kind of missed that in Warship, so it was pretty fun because it was more of a strategic game. And I guess there is strategy in going fast, but it just seemed like Russian and there was no time for fun, if you guys know what I mean, in some of the battles. Um, if they made defense way overpowered this season, there would be a chance. Who knows? Maybe in later engine rooms there will be overpowered defense. But um, you guys see what I mean? Like, um, it, it would just be like maybe you could actually use a mech strategy then because they're slow and they would just pursue through the base. But then sometimes the battles would get a little bit long because did I mention they're slow earlier? I think I did, but just gonna mention it again you can see we barely took one engine room we have all of our mechs down by the way and uh our base is completely destroyed i wish i was using heavy rush but uh i don't hate mechs as much as i used to back when they were first released i was like these are pointless i'll use them because they're new but then a couple weeks ago i did a 16 no i was doing the every single troop versus all sniper towers i think and the mechs beat it i was kind of surprised by that i was like you know we're gonna have to try this against um against like player bases or i don't know if i did war factory or something like that and they were pretty strong i was like you know mechs aren't that bad and now we got the mech season i was very excited for it but here we are just waddling through the base going very slow maybe if they buffed mechs up to be very fast in warships made it like a mech 2.0 and essentially the same but they were just quicker maybe they would get used then you could use like smoky mechs or something um what i'm gonna do actually i got the upgrade points and since i have an excuse to upgrade the gumbo let's just max that out get us up to 52 energy 
And let's hop into a couple more attacks. We're able to take up the bases here, no problem, but uh, it's just time is the issue here. And look at the defenses here are just getting incredibly stronger. Um, now, I was in like wood when I first started this season. And uh, my last attacking spree was two, so it's not very competitive down there, so to speak, but um, we're doing good. I didn't realize there was... There's free upgrade tokens and unlock tokens in the shop, and I just found that out today. Um, I haven't used the uh, unlock tokens, but I did use the upgrade tokens on both the mech and the gunboat. So great job spending it. Um, very, very good at budgeting here. Do we have a chance this attack? Let's let's get a few GBE here. Let's flare them. 15 energy. Now I'm sacrificing my three mechs over here essentially. We're just going to hope we're able to... Okay, our base has fallen. We're not even close to taking it out, but who knows? Maybe my very poor defensive layout is... is well, I like my layout because it's spread out the engine rooms, but just, like, I have no defense upgrades, really. Um, that, that's... Uh, yeah. We, we're strictly on offense this season so far. My defense will catch up eventually, though. I know I was, I was just complaining about how defense... I wish it was overpowered, and then I don't even upgrade the defense. A little bit uh, hypocritical there, but um, I'm just going to assume it's not a meta to go strong defense this season. But who knows, maybe in the later stage, like I said. But our three remaining mechs, they are just going to go for this engine room now, and we'll have a swift, probably around 225 here, 224 attack left on the clock. There we go, able to power through it. I was suffering a little bit, but George, you're able to pick up the free dub here. Ooh, that was close. He only had 315, but we're able to get a chest here. We want that, and we'll take it. Can I, I, I'm pushing for barrages now. Now what do I want? Do I want the boom cannon or the two cannons? I'm just gonna go for the boom cannon. Can I switch it? Yeah, later I can switch it. I got enough diamonds for now. I didn't buy those diamonds either. I just don't really spend diamonds, so. After a while, you kind of get them saved up. Um, on in Boom Beach, I really only buy the boosters usually. And it's just booster now. I just buy the instant training. That's like essential. Um, but we just kind of place that boom cannon down randomly. Let's hop into one more mech battle. Because I don't want to lose too much. And then, probably after the video, I'll just switch over to Heavy Rush. Push myself back up. Get the remainder of my chest for now. Um, but... I really wish I had two more energy when I placed it down, because I could use a battle orders. It might make brick die a bit faster, but our mechs wouldn't have I wouldn't have to watch my mechs suffer as they ran up on this beach. And brick almost died, but let's get that battle order. She might die quicker than I want, but we're gonna be able to get her through our first engine room. And my cat is outside my door trying to get in. It's pretty distracting. He does not give up. Much like my mechs here. Let's get another battle orders, and then we probably won't be able to spend GB for a couple seconds here until we get that second boom cannon. And then should I just flare onto the engine rooms? Rest in peace, Brick. You were a tough one. Great job, this attack. We were able to use you twice with your ability at least, and you did a little bit of extra damage. Uh, but let's get a terrible shock bomb onto the one boom cannon instead of both. Let's get another one. Hopefully hit both. There we go. What a fail. It's not like I have a chance in these attacks either. Well, well, I shouldn't say that because I have seen other people using mechs on the warship this season. So, I don't know if you can hear my cat or not, but it's getting pretty obnoxious out there. Let's get a flare onto that final engine room. My engine room count has dwindled to one here. Let's get a shock onto that boom cannon. Oh my gosh, just look at those pelicans. I mean mechs. Oh man, that person took out my base 226, a bit quicker than my 224 attack, but let's see, did he just start late or did we get a fairly close attack here, 229, oh man, if we couldn't win that battle, I don't think we're going to win any battles here today, sadly, I maxed out my mechs for this, ah, uh, I'm already feeling the regret, but it was worth it, I have fun with mechs, even though they were slow, but I would have had more fun if we were able to place more down. But also, I don't, I didn't really have enough GBE to do that. So, I guess A was enough. But that's going to be it. Um, let me know if you guys have used the max 
beyond just like trying it out once and then realizing it wasn't smart because I did a whole uh, about 10 minute attack session here on it and we went 0 for 4. Nice. Great job, Max. Um, you did a great job powering through, but that's going to be it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in tomorrow's Boom Beach video. Bye-bye.